Alrighty, what we have here is an Epiphone SG. It's one of the newer ones. Just giving her a test drive. This thing, it is a satin cherry finish, which is really comfortable. I put a little bit of linseed oil on the finish just because it kind of smooths it up a little bit. The wood was dried out quite a bit. And also when I put Gage 8 Diodero strings on it, I put some Jin Dunlop lemon oil on the fretboard. That really freshened up the wood quite a bit. Plays a lot nicer and smoother now. But when I got this thing to test it, um, I wasn't sure about the two knobs versus the four knob deal that uh, most Gibsons come with. So you got a volume and a tone and then a three-way selector. The three-way selector works the same as just your standard Gibson three-way, but you've got a master volume and a master tone for each pick pickup selection, which at first I thought, eh, it's only got two knobs, I'm not sure I'm going to like it, da 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 but as I monkeyed around with this thing, I kind of like the two knob setup. It's a lot simpler, a lot faster to use on stage and stuff. And it's a uh, bolt on neck, which is fine. Bolt on necks are fine. And I think this thing goes for around like 200 bucks. Something like that, depending on where you get it. And it's just got your simple dot markers on the neck, which are fine. I think there's some binding on it, maybe. I don't know. Some black binding. I don't know. You can't really notice it, but it's a really nice guitar. The intonation is perfect. Um, no, none of the notes buzz out anywhere on the neck, which is really cool. And it stays in tune. And these pickups. These pickups are great. I don't know what kind of pickups those are. I guess I could look it up on Google, but... These things really got some bite, which we will see when we plug it in here in a little bit. But all in all, it's super light. It does not weigh hardly anything, so it's super comfortable to wear. And uh, I like it a lot. I'm real impressed with it. Not sure if I'm going to uh, take it on stage. I probably will. Sometimes I get guitars that I really like that I don't want to take on stage because I don't want them to get damaged somehow. Somebody spilling a beer on it or something or whatever. But uh, no, little uh, Epiphone SG. It's a wonderful little axe. And we are going to plug it into, in a minute, the little Fender Mustang, which uh, has tons of amp modeling in it and it's real cool, so blah blah blah. But uh, yeah. Epiphone SG. We'll see what it does. Back in a minute. 